Okay, today we're going to be talking about how to add channels to our scan for when we do data logs, all right? As you can see, I already have short-term fuels, fuel pressure. This is a different truck. This is actually a turbo truck, but it's going to be the same for every vehicle, all right? So the, what you're going to do is you're going to come here to where it says add channel. Click on it. Wait for it to populate. So once it populates, you can go to engine, click on engine, come down to fuel, open and close loop, you can click on oxygen sensor, we can get our bank one, bank two voltages, for example they're going to be our first, our second, right, once we get those we can even add our O2 heaters if we really wanted to, to get some more shirts stuff but once you get into closed loop fuel learning we can see that these are already highlighted but if I wanted them I would just click them whichever ones I want and, and as I click them it's adding them right now to our different stuff that we want to see all right different stuff different vehicles if we tell you hey we need to see your intake cam degrees angle you could go here and start clicking your different intake cams stuff like that so if you want to go to fuel system you can even go into pressures you can see your fuel pressure you know fuel volumes give you a couple different options Either way, this is going to be how you add different channels to your data log to your scanner to be able to see what is going on. All right. We could even do, say, injector flow rate. I mean, there's just so much things to add that some people want to see, some people won't, depending on what vehicle you have. Is where it's going to be all right different knock retards most tuners are going to want to see you know your basic stuff here your long-term short-term fuel trims your engine rpms your mass air your intake manifold pressure your timing advance so different different tuners will want to see different things you know ethanol fuel percent if it's e85 you know it's going to tell us it when you add e85 if you already had 93 in it your ethanol fuel percent is going to start telling you where it's at if you have a e85 flex fuel sensor of some sort on there so if i have 93 and i add five gallons of e85 then it's going to tell me hey now on my full fuel content is say 50 percent ethanol depending on just how much fuel I had in there, how much E85 I dumped in there. So take some time, go in there, just explore. You can go in there and explore and, and, and see different things you can add. And then, as always, talk with your tuner and see what they personally want you to data log when you're doing your data logs. Most of them are you know, pretty simple when it comes to NA builds, i.e. all motor. There is some different stuff that you'll be adding depending on your tuner of what they want to see if you are boosted. Oh.